Good afternoon, folks. This is Fred Campos, owner of DFW Website Designers. Happy December 26th, day after Christmas. Hope you guys had a wonderful holiday. This is episode number 277 of your three business tips at three o'clock in and around three minutes. As we end this year, if you did, if you missed yesterday's episode, I want to spend the next seven, this is episode number two, uh, end out 2021 with everything I've learned about small business working with 450 different clients. And what we're discussing this week is time hacks, how to make better use of your time. Because as you know, business owners, your time is probably the most valuable thing that you can do. And we talked yesterday about pretending it was the day before your vacation and about making really good use of, of times and things that you do. Today, we're going to talk about raising prices, cutting hours, and exclusive services. Now you'd be thinking, what does raising prices have anything to do with time hacks? Well, if you're like me, you get to a certain point where you get a number of customer base where you starting to lose control of your time, which is what really started my absence for the past quarter. And my phone rang off the wall, I was dealing with customers. When you get to about a certain turning point, if you're in a service industry like me, apparently when I pass 400 clients is when things begin to have wheels off. And at that point, you need to start reevaluating where your prices are. I've met with lots of small businesses. Uh, my friend over Frank over at Greentop, his first year in business, he was very economical. And then as his business grew, he slowly started raising prices. As I look into 2021, I want to be able to take better care of customers and perhaps have fewer customers, but still keep the revenue base where it is. And the only way to do that is to raise prices. If you offer a great service, raising prices won't be that big a deal because service is where it's at. People should not be buying based on price, and that's a lesson I've learned the hard way. Plus, what I can tell you is those that tend to be the cheap clients tend to be the highest in support. So price is associated with good service. There comes a point where you need to raise your prices. Number two, as a business owner, you try to be everything to everybody. I've watched this with lots and lots of different service industries, particularly I've seen this happen with dentists, where when they first start out, I've helped two dentists with new websites. They have hours from 7 a.m. to 7 p.m. six days a week. But once they get their base, they start cutting back on the hours. And that's what we're doing here at DFW Website Designers. In fact, we're going to be closed now on Mondays starting in 2022. We're only going to operate Tuesday through Saturday, and we're only going to operate from 10 to 6. And the main reason I wanted that to push back to 10 o'clock is so that me, the business owner, can work with staff, get things done, have that special time of most productive time in the morning. And by doing so, the only way to do that is to cut back on hours, which segues way perfectly into business tip number three, exclusive services. All of this may sound crazy when you're starting out, but once you have a base, you can't treat everybody equally. And think about this, this isn't the way it works in the real world. If we're gonna fly, we have the coach seats, we have the business class, and we have first class. Any type of service that you provide should have one level of exclusive services. I've tried so hard to offer unlimited um, changes in the website business, and some clients abused it and some clients didn't use it. And I can't continue to do that for a standard price when I offer such good services. So I'm gonna create a tier of what I'm gonna call exclusive services, and it's something that you should do too. So time hacks, you're thinking all of this has to do with the way you operate your business. Yes, but the goal of this is to give you, the business owner, more time by raising prices, cutting hours, and offering exclusive service. As we journey towards the end of 2021, I'm gonna to continue to share tips that I've learned because I want you guys to be awesome. Now go back to sleep.